idea of having the perfect routine, the perfect morning ritual so that you can have the perfect audition, so that you can give the performance of a lifetime that you're gonna to have to do these 16 things and feel a certain way and feel totally ready and released. And in, instead of how you might feel in your dressing room, which is throwing up and like you can't breathe. And so what happens when you're in your dressing room and you're throwing up and you can't breathe? Is you have to turn the focus on, I'm, I can't breathe right now, what does that feel like? What is the feeling of not being able to breathe? I feel hot, I, my heart is racing, I just threw up, I taste that in my mouth. Allowing the, 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 the most common thing that happens to actors that stops them in a big audition is that they get, they get really nervous, their body starts responding, you start having the atoms move around in a different way. It's named as a negative experience and then it's pushed away, it's pushed aside. And then the spinning out begins. So, uh, you know, the, the, the way in which we, we try to assign something to our experience of, of going through the world. And yes, sadness comes up and we should grieve and feel it fully, right? But I remember, you know, what if you could truly go to the audition and get a flat tire and spill your coffee all over yourself and have the security be a dick to you as you drive through and have it all be great. Have it all be is. Guy was a dick. Cool. I'm, my heart's racing. My palms are sweating. Yes. <laughs> yes, and here we go. I, I, can, I can act through all of that as long as I don't try to push it away, cancel it out. We, you can redirect, you can reroute. 